Now, um, the second thing is that um, I should mention, for God to exist uh, in the programmer analogy, loop quantum gravity would have to be proven, and string theory would have to be disproven. And there's a reason for this. String theory, uh, in its own format, postulates that the finest minute amount of matter um, is uh, compressed strings, uh, either strings or superstrings, very small minutes of matter. This also postulates uh, up to 10 or 11 su uh, d some dimensions, some of which are no bigger than a micron across, like about the size of an electron. If these hyper, -dimen hyper small dimensions existed, then therefore loop quantum gravity would be able to fit in as an extrapolation of string theories being, well, we've already got micro dimensions, why not minute amounts of space and time too? Like that could be, you know, there might be a connection between those two. Um, if string theory were proven, it would disprove it anyway. Um, also, not to mention, um, also if string theory were proven and loop quantum gravity disproven, um, anyway, that would give an account for um, how the universe would have happened due to the uh, creation models that string theory has already been suggested.